Hello, I'm Lynn Sullivan, Sullivan's Par 3 Golf Course in Murray, Kentucky. And today I'm going to discuss uh, helping you eliminate a slice in the golf swing and the things that are related you know, to that slice. Uh, for one of the relationships with this slice is going to be the grip. And the grip that I would suggest is that you hold it in the finger such as this. Muscle pad of the left hand goes over in this position here. So the left hand falls in this position. Uh, one of the things I've always worked on on my golf swing, ever since I was probably seven to eight years old, every time that I look down at my golf grip, I make sure that I can see the second knuckle of my left hand in this position. With my right hand, I'm going to take the pinky of my right hand and the grip that I, I prefer, and there are many options, but I do prefer that the pinky lays on similar to this. In my right hand, the fingers go on such as this, so that the right hand fits this way, over the top. Now, in relationship to a slice, uh, gripping it this way, uh, what, what happens with many golfers when they play, they take the club back, and in the process of making a good golf swing, the golfer doesn't realize it, but most people automatically hinge their wrist. And in the hinging of the wrist, the club face is in an open position. In other words, the club face starts here, but, but in the process of the swing, the club face is opened up approximately 45 degrees. So as they take the swing down, the club face is still in an open position, such as this. Well, most golfers that I generally see that slice the ball, the biggest part of their slice is the club face angle at the moment of impact. So at the moment of impact, the club face comes through just like this. So the ball obviously is going to go dead right. My suggestion is this, that we, we set up, we take it back the same way as you start your downswing, keep your arms in very close to your body, keep your hands close to your body, and at this point right in here, and you see where my hands are in relation to my hip, you, you have a rotation with the, left, the last three fingers of your left hand. And what you will find if you, the, the new cameras they're using uh, to film PGA Tour players show very, very slow motion, and they show what the touring pros are doing. And what you'll see on player after player after player, if you analyze it, is you'll see their hands in this position, the club face here, and you'll see with their hands close to their body, their arms close to their body, you're going to see the club face uh, start rolling over such as this by, by the left wrist rotating, the hands rotating. And if you notice, my whole body is rotating as well coming through the impact zone. 